Alrighty guys, so uh, doing a little review today. I'm going to be showing you my uh, duck butt pulsator I made. It's literally the same thing as a, um, it might be the Higdon, I'm not sure. But basically the same exact deal going on here. So, price wise, depending on what you have, if you have like zip ties and just like tape and things it might save you a little money but it's gonna be around 50 or 60 dollars to make this so if you don't already have one of these you can buy a two pack for about 20 bucks um, this thing the uh, pump was about 20 dollars and uh, I went to I think advanced auto picked up this blinker switch I got the heavy duty one that's what everybody recommended and uh, right now I have these two 6 volt batteries in it I'm gonna get a full 12 volt for it though but right now this works too if you wanted to just cross bridge these um, but yeah I just have it running straight through my box here with some Gorilla plastic stuff on it and then the uh, the hot wire runs straight to the battery, and uh, you basically run the negative from the pump to this blinker switch, and make a bridge, and then run it to your battery. So it's nothing fancy. And then all I did with this is I, I couldn't really find a uh, hose that would fit it right, so I took some old electrical stuff and just zip tied it tight and then taped it up so no water could just like spray at the sides and then I took a zip tie and did that so we'll put it in the water for you and show you how it works yeah guys so that's basically how it works right there and uh Gonna have to go get that. But um, one thing to keep in mind is the box floats. And I don't think I mentioned that the box is about $20 too at Walmart. But the box floats, so I'm gonna have to rig up something. Either put a weight in the box or put a weight hanging off the box. But uh, yeah, it does a pretty awesome job actually. And um, if you had it weighted down, I think it would actually work better because it would kind of sit more upright. Because right now it's kind of slanted. But when it, uh, when you have weight dragging it down a little bit, it'll kind of pick back up and it'll do a little bit more wobbling. Yeah, guys, that's the uh, duck butt pulsator. If you have any questions, comment down below. See you on the next one.